Thanks. Now let's jump into your big three stories of the day. Lots to get to on the news front as well. President Biden in Pittsburgh, part of a campaign sweep across the Keystone State, understanding that Pennsylvania may be the key to winning or keeping the White House uh, for each candidate. That's right. Talking with union workers today at uh, union headquarters in Pittsburgh. We're also talking about a pause in the Trump trial. This is now uh, day three. Seven jurors have already been picked. We're going to be hearing more about what's next. And some consternation in Ashtabula County, Ohio. Neighbors there upset about plans for a poultry processing plant in a residential neighborhood. We have details in just one moment. Well, we're going to move to the main desk, though. We're going to talk a little bit more about these stories, and we head to Ashtabula County, Ohio tonight. Indeed, neighbors there upset about the proposed development of a poultry processing plant in a residential neighborhood. It's located on Depot Road in Saybrook Township. That's about a block away from the St. John's School. The neighborhood is primarily residential, but the Saybrook Zoning Board approved a commercial zoning variance that allows owner James Buck to open the plant. Once it's up and running, he says the general public will be able to drop off chickens for processing. Not only is it close to a school, neighbors say they're concerned about the negative effect it could have on property values. A zoning inspector says neighbors can file an appeal and voice their frustrations. Pennsylvania's primary is less than a week away, and this year, Erie County residents will have a faster, better way to view real-time results. The county is launching this election results web page, which not only shows vote totals in real time, but also allows viewers to customize their formats to closely track the races that matter the most to them. In years past, the county posted PDFs of results, making the new website a significant upgrade. There is a link to the site on eriecountypa.gov on the Election and Voter Registration Department page, and we hope to put it on our website as well. Of 